Hello there. I'm going to be running a quick 60-second uh, ad so that anybody joining in the stream will not get the pre-roll ads for a while. Um, I will start the stream right after that, though. See you in a bit. Welcome back from the uh, break, by which I mean the 60 second ad that I just ran. We are back, in fact, to Dyson Sphere. Let's get into it. Let's continue where we left off on uh, Tuesday, whatever the heck day it was. I don't know what we we're doing. I know that we have a... Uh, your lair begun? Running out of sales. Don't have a lot of sales. That's a thing. We need to go check on that. I think I'm close to that, right? These don't make any sound effect when they shoot people like they used to. So I, w I watched like the briefest clip yesterday of somebody playing Dyson Sphere. And, uh, I saw just their, what they had going on in a different planet entirely. And I'm thinking I might do something. No, not, I don't want to do exactly that. That's not how I've been playing this, right? I might do that. Okay, so we're just mining this here, but that's almost gone. Are you getting any other steel from anywhere else? Are you? Why are you supplying? I feel like you should be taking from off planet. Okay, 
so what you gonna do? Yeah, I could probably make the sales off for sure. You take the sales, see if you can do this. What does it take? What makes a man? Who's making this? Where are you guys making this at? That's it. Is red? No. Well, we got a bunch of these. We don't have a lot of power, though. And that's probably because our dice is here. Isn't really great. So that's going over here. and the, the things from glass. He's still not doing any of that. Maybe we just do a little bit of that. Yeah? Maybe we just stock these up. Entirely. We just need to do some sales. We've got lots of these. building it. We're building it. That's good. What can I research? Well, what we wanted to research was this. Get an addic uh, additional 15%. We could try it. Do I know how many I have of things? Is that like a, a thing? Is that a deal? Do I know how many I have? There's a way to tell how many of anything that I have. Can I have like a larger inventory? Show me how much stuff I have. back into upgrades, what can I do here? Probably most of these at this point. Oh, this doesn't even take green? Hell yeah. Do you. Right quick. You don't take green? Yup. You don't take green. engine level four of this. Wait, what? Oh, drove. Drove. Right. Where's drive engine? Is that on the other page? No. Things on this page. 
except for those. Drive engine. Where are you at? Drive engine. What am I missing here? Oh, look at that. We got lots of purple here. That's good. Why are you demanding iron? Oh. Okay. That is going where? I don't remember. Once we get drive engine level four, we have to do this. Is that what I saw? Now are you breaking it? Look at you. Look at you guys. You're not doing anything over here. Solar sails are going to stay an extra 450 seconds, which is nice. So you are... It's power supply. Low on. Great. Because this is all right, folks. We should make some more of those. We know we're going to need more of those. Just 
you know, we'll just do a little thing over there, since that's not using it. Wow, that's going pretty quick. Hold up. Are we making these over here? Oh, I was like, where's that coming from? It's coming from these. Encroaching on you. Have reached the ability to warp. Yes, when I you're have. out of the planetary gravitational range, you can use the caps lock key to turn on the warp. Each time you turn it on, it will consume a great amount of energy and an additional space warper. If you want to travel freely between the stars, you need to prepare sufficient energy. Oh, I don't and have space any of those. Warpers. So that's a thing. All right, we're not satisfied. We are not satisfied on our power. And I believe, in part, it is because we are severely lacking on these sails. Which is good that we're not now. Well, hopefully this will help. sorts of useless to me right now. I mean, it is my only means of anything, really. But I need it to do... I, I mean, I'm so far into it. I can't... I can't really change the production that I've already started is the issue. for something a while ago, I'm sure.
who's making the hole over here? Who's digging the hole? You. I guess kinda. the vein quicker, but could be getting more. Who's, who's doing these? Supply? From where? All the way over here. Because we have one thing producing them. <laughs> All right. I think I might go to a different plant and just start some stuff. Start some production. what I need if I'm going to a new planet to just start over. <laughs> it's not even start over. Why do I have so much titanium just in there? Who can produce, who, who's smelting titanium? Who's making ingots? No. Does anybody make ingots anymore? Did I just delete that? Okay. some bricks. I have enough space in my inventory. There we go. more of these. Where'd you 
Mega Circuits. It does not make sense for me to have this just sitting in my inventory. Oh. Build up that quickly. What's up, Beast? How are you doing today? Seconds, I'll take it. Is that like two and a half minutes or two and a half minutes? Seven and a half minutes? All right. Oh, I have no idea why I'm shot. I don't know that I would ever figure out why my ship sank after it sank. It's just gonna happen. Cranial, welcome. How you doing? How, Cranial, how are you doing? I'd like to specifically call out that right now I'm asking you, how are you doing today? on this lovely, lovely evening. How are you doing today at this, um, 11.26 p.m. GMT? <laughs> I'm good. <laughs> See, I even know that you're in, well, I, I know that it's Greenwich Mean Time. Medium? Greenwich? GMT, whatever the heck. Greenwich something. I know how to pronounce Greenwich, damn it. <laughs> oh, you know, we're doing good. Just showing the guns today. It's a guns day because tomorrow. I, I, I tend to every now and again wear the, the shirt that I'm going to wear for my morning workouts. <laughs> and on uh, Tuesday, 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 Thursday. Wait, what? No, Monday, thir Monday, <laughs> Monday, Wednesday, Friday. I um, I do a workout that I do wear no sleeves, sleepless on. Bob's out. Ooh, see, I'm not that kind of streamer. By the way, after our conversation the other day talking about that, I was on Twitch the other day. It was just like on the homepage, and it was so funny. It was like popular channels right now. It was so funny the number of them that were just girls. Like there was one that was literally just thick stream. It was T-H-I-C-C -C stream, that kind of thick stream. And it was a girl just sitting in super short shorts with a real tight top on, lounging on a bed, looking at her screen. I was like, Cranial, I'm telling you, man. <laughs> it's not just me. Did I see your, I didn't watch. I don't care to watch. I don't care to just watch people who have no, like people aren't watching that for the content. <laughs> well, what are you missing? 
Oh, what are we missing over here? How do we have these? It's just super slow at producing. What are you talking about? Did I see your what? Your bobs? No. Okay. That. Look, we're stacking up again. That's good. How many of these do we have now? We're at 3,000. That's good. That's good. They're going to last even longer, so our power should be a little bit better here. Um, so I'm doing something today on the street. That sounds like different than what I mean. Um, I'm doing something in this game differently today. Oh my god, we're running out of everything. I need to go up to a different planet and set up a different kind of shop. Did I see your channel there too? No, I did not see your channel there. I hope that you have not debased yourself to that. So I need, I've been building lots of things in my inventory. Water? Water? Hydrogen. Who needs hydrogen? Who needs De De Deuteronomy? I, I wish I could put deuterium in, the, in these. Can I give you guys some, hey, can you take this? Yeah, you can take that, nice. Who wants some hydrogen? You'll take some hydrogen. You'll take a little bit of hydrogen. Are we doing power? We're good. Cranial, do you even have a channel? That you stream on? I should say, because technically, I guess if you have an account, you kind of have a channel, right? Do you really? You don't save your videos? Am I not following you? There you go, now you're following. I'm gonna be notified when you stream. When you stream at like, uh, like 6 a.m. my time. I'm gonna be like, I'm not waking up. need plastic in my body. Who needs plastic? We're just getting rid of things right now. That's what we're doing. Yeah, I feel like I just need to make a production planet. Where are you going? Who needs graphene? You are using all the graphene. Carbon nanotubes. Did I put anything here? No. Who's taking carbon nanotubes? Where's the out? That's the out. So carbon is going into these. You need carbon? No. You need this. You need carbon? Can you take some carbon? Yeah, you can take the carbon. Why do I have 11 of these crystals?
most of my inventory is just <laughs> conveyor belts. Oh, duh. We're going to need a bunch of these. Right. That is unfortunate. Detroit! Detroit? Uh, where is Detroit from here? Cranial, do you actually stream? I see you don't have any VODs. So now I'm just wondering if you're, if you're just ghost, or not ghost, but gaslighting me. This is why you, I don't trust you guys, by the way. <laughs> because of the lying. That's really why. <laughs> Are you saying you don't have any boobs? So you don't wait, you can say boobs in chat, you know. but I need more of them. Yeah. We're not going to have a lot of that, unfortunately. So what do we have on this planet? I guess I don't really need to start there. I can put stuff on this planet. So we've got a lot of stone there. We don't have a lot of coal, though. How much coal is on that other planet? Silicon, where are we holding you at? We get a, just a little bit, a little, little bit of extra silicon in us, just in case. And then, got that. how many of these do we have? I can make one because I don't have magnets. somewhere else making magnets. Are you sending out magnets? No. Are you sending out? Who's sending out magnets? Who's making? Where have we got magnets? We've got magnets somewhere else, right?
Alright, we're running out of titanium beams. I think that's what they are. I don't know what they are. Where were we even making this? Right here, somewhere. In here? Yeah. You guys take... Ooh, sulfuric acid. That's not good. So slow. Sulfuric acid is being made over here. Is it fine though? Like how much? How much? Good. Is that even making that? No, that's not making. That was only for that. Wow, these take a long time to make. Titanium alloy, what did that take? It's just from steel. That's not difficult at all. Sulfuric so acid. Yeah, oil, stone, and water, which we don't have on the other plane, so it has to be made. I edited this playlist, by the way. This is not actually the YouTube video. By playlist, I mean the 12 hour video. This is not actually that 12 hour video. That 12 hour video. Um, oops. Downloaded it, removed the one song that, keep, that will get copyright up. And 
notification on it on YouTube. And um, I I'm not editing videos. I don't have edit I don't have video editing software. Um, I downloaded the video just the uh, as audio. I, I have Audacity, so I can clip audio. I can edit audio. Um, but I downloaded it, edited the audio, and just clipped out the one song. So now if I use this in the background of my stuff, I shouldn't have any issues. Because none of the other songs are getting fired, or copyright. Notifications. I haven't gone back through and edited my YouTube videos at all, and I'm not going to. They're just going to be the raw output from this. Um, I don't have the time to learn how to do the editing. Or rather, I'm not taking the time to learn how to do the editing, as well as go through my streams and find, like, highlight stuff to do that. I don't have the. I, I currently do not have the skills for that, nor the passion. Oh, also, um, so I was thinking about this because I've been like doing some job hunting and whatnot. Um, cranial. At some point, if and when I do get another nine to five job, if I continue streaming, you're probably not going to see me anymore. We're, we're probably not going to see each other anymore after that. Because the only time I would be streaming is after 6 p.m. here, which would be all during your nighttime when you when you're actually asleep. Because this is 100% not a job for me. I am not making any money off of Twitch streaming, nor was that the intent. That'd be cool, but that was not, I guess it's not intent. That, that was never the expectation. What are we doing with this? Do I only have two of those making? I don't know if it's so much that. Just gotta get lucky. Inventory full. No, 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 no. Get out of here.
Ah, dang it. Oh, right. Totally. Twitch is buggy. How do you mean? Is stream not working? I don't know what to tell you about that. That doesn't seem to be a Twitch thing. That seems to be a you thing. That Well, that 100% confirms that it is a you thing, not, a, not necessarily a Twitch thing. Well, it still could be a Twitch thing, but I don't know. If the problem follows you, you are probably the problem. Um, what are you watching on? A computer? Or a phone? Or a TV? That's not true on either of those platforms. That is categorically false that neither of those places want you to see, um, want you to see ad blocks or ads. They very much want you to. And when they find a way to block the ad blocker, they will. It's just that there are also people on the side of ad blockers that are working against that. doesn't care cranial you got your head in the sand if you think youtube doesn't care that you don't see that you, if you're not seeing ads that just means that the people working for twitch are better at it at getting at, at, at working against ad blockers and it means that ad blocker people who are doing ad blockers are better against youtube the people working at youtube I can tell you right now, there is a constant struggle for for you for video services for you to see their ads. Yeah, because that's a way to get you to turn off your ad blocker. What ad blocker do you use?
No, it was, you said that it was off on that site. They might still be able to tech that you have it on your browser. Exactly. They can detect that because it's probably easier to detect that than to detect whether... They don't care that you have it on or off necessarily, but if you have the potential for it, I mean, it might be easier for them to detect whether or not you have the potential for it. Ad blockers are not good things for companies that are trying to make money. It's business. You gotta understand that. You're technically here, you are the one doing the bad thing. You realize that, right? Not, I mean, it's not bad, but you are the one here doing the thing that is stopping them from making money. You are intervening to stop the intended use of the platform. What, what ad block do you use? Back to that question. No, but what I'm saying is you have it on your, I'm, I'm not, I'm saying that you have it on your, on your computer at all. So you clearly are intending to block ads somewhere, which is against the intended use of those services. I, I don't know what that means. There is no regular ad blocker. Do you mean like Adblock Plus? Do you mean uBlock Origin? What is the extension? Because Chrome doesn't have an ad blocker. It's, you have to get an extension for an ad blocker. Because there are different ones out there as well. So Adblock is not a good one anymore. It used to be good. Adblock is not good anymore. It gets blocked by a lot of things or a lot of places know it. Um, I recommend getting uBlock Origin. as a more effective adblock extension. I don't have adblock plus anymore. That, Cranial, that could mean that they updated their Twitch software. <laughs> do You do realize that, right? Like, come, it's not like they're like, oh, well, shit, there's a new adblock. I guess we can't do anything about it. It means they updated their system. You're smarter than that, come on. It, it doesn't mean they didn't update their system. Okay, so so I guess, here, I'm going to pause the game right now. Here's the thing. Something has changed in the way that you're receiving Twitch, correct? Yes, something has changed in how you're receiving, receiving, or how you are viewing Twitch, something has changed. Meaning, there is a new thing in the whole process that has changed. So you can continue complaining about it and getting upset about it. I'm not saying like you're freaking out, but you know, you're clearly, a, you're, something has caused a change in this and you don't like it. You can continue not liking it or you can try to do something about it. In this, and accept the fact that something is different and do something about it. But continuing to say, but, I, but before it was the same, that means something has changed. And now you gotta work around that. That's always gonna be the case when you're working with ad blockers. There will always be updates to the front end of the systems and the back end of the systems. But the thing is, the fact... It's not like... It, it is, though, Cranial. What, it's, not, it's, not, it's not... Twitch and YouTube and video services don't... Holy snap! <laughs> Raid! With a party at 38, holy crap. All right, Cranial, we're gonna come back to that. <laughs> uh, I am a gladiator of the Jones variety, thank you very much. Cranial, we'll come back to this conversation about ad blockers. <laughs> Hello everybody, welcome to uh, my stream. My name is Gladiator Jones on the internet. In real life, that's not my name. Um, it would be very odd for my parents to call me that. My parents are not Elon Musk and, uh, whatever, and whatever her name is. <laughs> Where are we all coming from? Where are we all coming from? <laughs> Mr. Revan, or Mr. Re, is it Mr. Reva N7? Is N7 supposed to be like, you're talking like Mass Effect stuff there? 
thank you for the host. I really do appreciate that. It's so cool. This is now effect or er, raid. This is now my uh, like second raid ever. So that's pretty awesome. Welcome everybody. Oh snap! We got a follow. Thank you, Jason Bayer, for the follow. I appreciate that. You don't even know what I. You don't even know what I do when you follow. That is that is some blind commitment, and I appreciate that kind of commitment. <laughs> um, I mean, Larry, you're talking about you're talking about you're just talking about every type of gladiator. I, why would you why would you limit yourself in what you use as a gladiator? That just seems silly. If you if you say like, "Hey, I'm a gladi gladiator. I'm going to go to the gladiatorial arena and we're only going to use swords." Everybody's going to be like, "Well, heck, I'm going to just get, use a net then." That's it. <laughs> Alex, I assume you had something to do with this. Uh, so everybody, welcome, welcome. This is the most followers I have ever had, I believe, at one time. That's insane. <laughs> I mean, people, well, definitely the most followers, definitely, I think almost the most viewers. Um, yeah, but see, Larry, I'm not talking about being the typical gladiator. I'm not talking about being one of those, yeah, those gladiators that you can assume you know what they're going to do. I'm going to be a, I'm going to be a jack of all trades. I'm going to be a little okay. I'm going to be moderate with everything. Jeez, the follows. What is? <laughs> Thank you all. I gotta, I gotta expand my follower thing. Jeez, jeez. Come on, folks. We got Kazfe. We got Lightborn Cloud. We got Feedman. Feedman. Larry Miguel, of course. <laughs> Troy Agates, fifty-four. Thank you all very much. <laughs> oh, Alex, what did you do? Where did you do this? <laughs> So, uh, <laughs> yeah, dude, I'm not, I'm, so here's the thing, Larry. <laughs> or unless it's Troy A. Gates. I said Agates. I don't know why I said that. <laughs> um, Troy A. Gates. Thank you very much. You may be a scholar <laughs> of Greek and Roman history, but I, I am what they call a bullshitter. I d it's Dunning-Kruger right now. I don't know what I'm talking about, but I sound like I do. Um, I am a scholar of psychology and human resources. So if we want to talk about that kind of stuff, I can be an expert there. And video games. I do I do like video games a lot. Um, so thank you, everybody. Uh, just for those of you who are now here, thank you uh, for coming. I, am, I, don't, I keep putting my hand up, but it is over here, not on camera. Thank you, everybody. I can put this one up. That's better. Uh, we're playing Dyson Sphere Program right now. Troy, Troy Gates. All right, Troy Gates. Thank you. Thank you, Troy Gates. <laughs> Larry, don't come up in here with your expertise expecting everybody else to be at the equivalent level as you. <laughs> oh, so we're talking about Double Toasted right now. Okay, I see what's happening. <laughs> So yes, this is uh, this is Dyson Spear Program. It is a uh, a manufacturing simulator game. So if you know games like Factorio or Satisfactory, it's kind of like that. Uh, there's lots of games out there. This is in alpha, or this is in uh, early access, not alpha necessarily. Um, so the point of it is to basically you start out on a barren planet. You collect resources like copper, stone, and iron. You manufacture those into other things using things like these smelters and these manufacturer, these assemblers. You make them into different things. And eventually, you can go out into space or you can shoot things out into space like you see going on over here. If I go out into space and look at the space view, you can see here's the solar system that I am currently on. This is my home planet that I started on. I'm, sp I'm around this gas giant. All right, I'll still be on, Larry. Enjoy your Latin class. Um, so we got this uh, this solar system around which we uh, are or, or around which we are playing right now. We're orbiting this this sun. Um, this is a gas giant. I can't land on it, but I can put things to collect uh, resources from this gas giant. I can also go to other planets and collect things from those planets. So I have things being collected over here on this planet. Uh, this this last planet over here, Lambda Libre Four. Not a lot going on there. It's not got a lot of things that I want. Oh, thank you, Nightbot. Oh, thank you, Troy Gates. Yes, I, I do very much enjoy this playlist. It is 12 hours of Nintendo music, and it is fantastic. 
Oh, uh, Lightborn, this makes you feel small and insignificant. Well, let's let's scroll out even further. So this is my solar system, right? You see all these other dots in our galaxy. You can go to every one of those as well. The point is to make a Dyson sphere around the sun. <laughs> The point is to go around here. Thank you, Mary Joanna. Mary Joanna. I don't know why I tried to pronounce it once. I knew what it was, and then I said it. Mary Joanna, thank you. <laughs> you don't have a PC at all? Oh, boy. Well, that's okay. Eventually, we'll get one. Then you'll be able to play this game. The nice thing about it is everything is really low res or low poly. So it actually, like these out here, these little solar sails that I have that I've built, each of these are individually rendered. I actually sent all of these out here with my guns. Um, they're like, it's literally just this little hexagon. That's it. And if I go out there, they're a little bit higher render, rendering level. Also, this is not kind of the best view of this. This is just kind of my map view. Um, if you'd like to see what kind of PC I'm building, I just recently upgraded it. Um, build? Is it build? Is it, uh, oh my god. Cranial, help me out here. What's my, uh, what's my thing? <laughs> setup? There it is. You can see the, my setup, my current setup. Um, mind you, I built the base of it six years ago and then spent some more money recently to get some particular parts to upgrade to. But that's the computer I'm working on right now. I never remember what it is. I always say build or setup. I should just, you know what? Here we go, Nightbot. Add a command. Build. Did you? There we go. All right, so I've just made it so that build also gets that for me. Here we go. Ah, oh, you can't add punctuation after it. <laughs> uh, so yeah, um, thanks for everybody being here. Uh, I've talked about the game I'm playing right now, but also other games that I've been playing. I play things like Hitman. Sorry, I'm also looking over at my screen right here. Um, let's try this. Oh, come on, Nightbot. You're supposed to do the other thing too. Anyway, that's fine. Uh, I've been playing Dyson Sphere Program right now a lot, but I also have been playing uh, Sea of Thieves I just started getting into, and that's very fun. We're having a lot of fun with that. You can check that out in my VODs and some crazy highlights of me getting jump scared of things. Um, I don't know why, but I've, I've been getting jump scared a lot. I've also been playing Hitman. I think I just said that. Um, I was playing Shadow of Mordor recently. Going to go into Shadow of War because I just beat Shadow of Mordor. Uh, on Sundays... I'm in Pacific time, by the way. On Sundays, I play Dro Bro Times Fun Times, BTFT, uh, with my brother. We're currently running through uh, Divinity Original Sin, so that's fun. And then eventually, just my uh, my larger um, kind of sub goal, I can show this up, bus goal. I wrote a little bit dyslexic there, and I about typed a bus goal. I don't have a bus goal. But at 25 subs, I'm going to, one, shave off the face, because not just all of my face, but just the hair on it, because that seems to be a thing that people do for sub goals. As well as do an ASM Are You Afraid of the Dark stream. Now, if you'd like to know what that is, it's going to be a, a stream where I try to speak in dulcet tones into my microphone in a very ASMR kind of way, but also playing scary games like Five Nights at Freddy's, um, Resident Evil other things like that, and try not to get jump scared while staying in the ASMR kind of tone. It's going to be a long stream, 12 hour stream, so I'm going to get tired, I'm going to get freaked out, and I get jump scared very easily. So it's going to be that kind of thing. So we, we play lots of games here, so if you're interested and you haven't followed already, hit that follow and you'll see it. You'll see that kind of stuff being played. Um, I like interacting with street or with chat. I know that there are some streamers who are kind of focused on their games. I'm one who I like to interact with chat as much as I can. So when you guys are here, it's even more fun for me. I play video games on my own, so that's cool too. But um, it's fun having people to, to kind of bounce stuff off of. So thanks for hanging out. Uh, if this is not your jam, that's cool too. Go find somebody else on Twitch who is your jam. There's lots of us here. 
Oh, and also, yes, Amazon Prime subs. If you got one of those and you're not giving it to anybody else, feel free to support me with it. But don't let it go to waste throughout the month. If you have Amazon Prime and you don't like what I'm doing and want to support me with that, that's okay. Find somebody on Twitch. Use that on them or use that for them to support them because it is free to you. Uh, I like to just kind of announce that Amazon Prime is uh, is a thing that people can use and uh, they go to waste every month. I let mine go to waste every now and again. I shouldn't do that. I should go find somebody that I like on Twitch and, and help support them. Yes, thank you, Lady Grey, all day. I meant to I meant to say that. Sorry. Thank you very much for following. I really appreciate you being here. And again, you all you guys have been seen me doing so far is just talking and flying around my planet, not actually doing any gameplay. I'm just flying around. Um, so I appreciate you guys giving me those blind follows. <laughs> um, this is what I do when I start talking on stream. I'm not good at, ma at, at multitasking in this game, in a manufacturing sim like this. So I end up just flying around a whole bunch and walking through things. I like to do figure eights around things, if I can get through them. I like to do that. You'll see me walk along uh, conveyor belts in straight lines because symmetry is lovely. Um, but here, I'm gonna go out to space. I'm gonna show you guys this. I showed you from uh, a different view what it's like to go out to space. I showed you from this view here, this, this solar system view. But I'm actually gonna fly out of this space. We'll show you what that's like. So now we're in space. Here's us with this little mech, this little mecha. There's our planet, there's our home planet. There's the gas giant we were on. This is a little bit better resolution. You can actually see what these things look like. So we're gonna go over to the sun. Where's the other planet? Where's our other planet? We're gonna get a little bit closer to the Dyson uh, swarm that we gotta go down. Well, thank you, Lady Grey, I appreciate that. I appreciate the compliment. I, pre I, I like to say I appreciate things. That's kind of my go-to phrase. I like to, uh, in, at work, I'm a presenter of things, or in my profession, I like to present a lot, and I look at, you know, one of the things they talk about to presenters is crutch phrases. My big crutch phrase on, um, on streaming is I appreciate that. <laughs> but I do, I legitimately do appreciate it. So this is uh, our Dyson Swarm that is going around the sun. That's collecting energy, solar energy, and sending it back to the planet down there that we are shooting more of these. Each one of those little blue things that's being shot out is another one of these. You can actually see them kind of exploding into existence when they get here. You can see them all being made. Ha <laughs> ha! I was gonna say, this is, I really do think this is a great playlist. I mean, if anybody is interested in the playlist that I'm using, it is from this video right here. That's the playlist I'm currently listening to. It is 12 hours of Nintendo music, of chill Nintendo music. I did not make it, but I'm using it because it's fantastic. Plus on stream, if I'm only streaming four hours at a time, I can use it for three streams without having to restart it. And that's just wonderful. I appreciate that. So, now I'm going to a different planet. This is my secondary planet. We're collecting some stuff here. You, there's no uh, damage in this game, so you can just run into the ground. Got a lot of wind power collecting here. We've got some things that are smelting all of this copper that we're, we're mining here, but it's smelting slowly, which is fine. And then we're sending it in here back to the home planet with these little, these little collectors up here. So we've got a lot of stuff going on this planet, which is pretty cool. Um, actually, where's my equator? Is that a pole? That's the pole, so we're on, we're like on the equator. Um, technically, I am using an edited version of that uh, playlist because there is one track out of the 12 hours that if and when I upload these videos to YouTube, gets a copyright claim on a very illegitimate copyright claim, but one nonetheless. So um, I've just edited that one song out so that we're not, you know, using some of these property that we can't use, really. Ooh, I could potentially start building over here. So what I want to do is go over here, and I think I want to start building some manufacturing over here. Oh, also, something about this uh, soundtrack, which I think is awesome, is that it does use multiple versions of the song Aquatic Ambience from uh, Donkey Kong Country. 
which is a fantastic song, and I'm actually just going to start the whole thing over so we can just hear that song. Um, this is just a great song. It's one of my favorite songs on this playlist. There's also one song on here that I just had never heard before. I don't know what it is. I don't know where it's at in the playlist. It's like at six hours or something. Um, and it's, it's, it's a song where I'm like, I legitimately really like this song. It's very good. And in 12 hours of music, you can, you, you know, you can find that kind of stuff. Could I start building stuff over here? I guess I could. Also, I might hum or sing along or whistle along with these songs, particularly this one, because it's just so good. I love it. Alright, we are getting lots of iron over here. Oh no, what are you doing? You don't have any, uh, come on now. How many of those do we have? We need to build some of these logistic drones. Which I can build 10, that's good. We need to get hydrogen from the home planet. Or are we just not sending it out quickly enough? That might be the case. Alright, so here's the deal. Nope. Get out of here, Cole. Also, there's a very good version of this song by a guy named Smooth McGrew on YouTube. He does acapella stuff. If that, if if it's what you're into. So before the uh, before the raid, what was everybody doing on the other? What were we doing on the other channel? What were we doing? What did Mr. Is it Mr. Revan? doing on that channel for mr r evan <laughs> i like knowing how things are pronounced i think names are important to me and i always feel bad when i am like i have no idea how to pronounce this thing alex i appreciate you responding to all my stuff but it's always so delayed, I never know which of my questions or which specific thing you're responding to. <laughs> which is why it's better when we're actually in a party chat on Sea of Thieves. <laughs> 100 percent satisfaction. Nice. That worked. That helped a lot. Oh, nice. That's awesome. And that's awesome for, that was a lot of people to be uh, supporting him on, uh, via Patreon. That's awesome. Oh, gotcha. <laughs> cool. I'm sure he's very happy that he has so many Patreons, patrons on Patreon rather. That's really cool. <laughs> you know what as a first impression i will take that i i will i will take that and and try to continue the vibe yeah i like to i i guess i, I haven't really talked about that i like to have uh, you know i think that uh, you know it's important to be nice to each other Ooh, ooh. no nope, sorry cranial no patreon show hit my only fans though get my only fans out there <laughs> that 
Thank you, Crane. Um, here's an important thing. Uh, give me some, Crane, give me some Ben Ice, please. This, I think, is most important to me. I mean, I could go over and type it, but I know that you're willing to type it for me, and I appreciate that. <laughs> ben Ice! I like to have Nightbot come in every now and again and tell everybody to be nice. I like to say Ben Ice, though. It's important to be nice to each other. Try to do something nice for each other every day to, for at least one other person. Make some other, somebody else smile. Even if you're having a bad day, someone else might be having a bad day, too. What if you give them a good day? How cool would that be? It doesn't hurt to be nice to each other. That's kind of what I like to have in my stream. I want people to be nice to each other. Positive attitudes. That kind of stuff. If you want to be negative, that's your prerogative, but let's try not to have that here, you know? Optimism. I live my life by a philosophy of never say can't. Everything is possible, you just gotta take ownership of it. Yeah, Cranio, Ben Ice. I say that every time I type be nice in chat. I always say Ben Ice. <laughs> it just, it sounds like I'm saying be nice real weird, though just like in a different uh, manner. All right, there we go, there we go, there we go. Do we get some more power? Oh, come on, you fool, you dummy. So this is kind of basically what the game is. You go around, you build all these conveyor belts, moving all of your uh, resources around, and then you move them with these sorters into machines that do things with them. So these are all just a bunch of uh, thermal generators, and I've got a bunch of hydrogen. Liquid hydrogen being produced, mind you. This is liquid hydrogen that is in these boxes. We are on a lava planet. So think about the efficiency of the cooling process for these packages. That's insane. But either way, we're going in here, we're burning all of that, so this just adds to our energy. So we've got 100% satisfaction, which is phenomenal. I like to leave my thermal, gener thermal generators 100% satisfied. What are you doing over here, Cole? Nothing? Where is the equator? Is that the equator? Yes. Yes, it is. Okay. Ooh. Where was I? I don't remember where I was going for this. Was I going on this side of it? I mean, I could. Do I have a lot of space to work with? Nah. I'm going to crash into something. Oh, we just... Wow, this is a tiny planet. have enough things for this. Oh, I can make 82 of these? Wow, I did bring enough stuff. in the ground. That's going to be an issue later. Okay. So what I'm going to do here is we're going to build one of these boys. <laughs> Was I whistling? Power over to it. And how 
far over here can we go? Lava, we don't need you. Okay. So what we're gonna do is we're going to just, oh my God, I have 99 of these, that's awesome. I feel like I need to just start with the basic resources again. I just need to start from scratch. I should build. I don't think I have anything that I can build this with. Nah. Bummer. What do those take to make? I'm gonna make titanium alloy. I have no sulfuric acid here, so that's not gonna happen. Um. Hey, yeah. Thanks, Mary Joanna. I uh, hope to see you back here. Uh, have a wonderful rest of your day. Get some stuff done around the house. You're proud about it. Chores are ne never necessarily fun doing them. Sometimes they are. I like cleaning every now and again, but uh, it's always satisfying once you've done them. I did my taxes the other day, and I feel great about it now. <laughs> Let's see. We'll go. Oh. That's not gonna. That's gonna be an issue for me right there. Can I build more. 